264 words for today, which I think is pretty productive for a Monday, which is so sad because used to, after I come back from the weekend, I hit the ground running. Monday, I just start out so strong, and it would slowly get, or not so slowly, get worse and worse and worse as the week went on. And now I just never like, get a good start. And it doesn't get one better usually either. It's just, how do you get worse as you go on? Shouldn't you be getting better? But I envy those days. But I said before, schedules never work for me. So once I start falling into a pattern, it starts to not work anymore. So, 110 on two different poems, which are both for my book. Speaking of falling out of patterns, I completely forgot Twitter today. <laughs> I didn't write any poems for there. I didn't even go to Twitter. It was really weird because I'm usually, like, obsessively checking my notifications. Um, is that weird? <laughs> So 110 poems on two different, two, 110 words on two different poems. Um, not all of the bad poems have been replaced. So, not saying that none need to be edited, but all the ones that I just wanted out of there, they're out now. I didn't want to take them out until I had poems to replace them. I have poems to replace them now. Um, well, one I replaced, one, I'll get to that story in a minute. 46 words of editing poems, which is a lot more than I usually get. The reason being, few, um, only like one word or just a little bit edited. One of them though, I had this idea for a poem, but I wasn't at the house. By the time I got to my computer, I wasn't entirely sure what the point was. I had written down some of the words I remembered, like the first part, and wasn't sure what the point I was getting to was or if I ever had one. I'm not sure if I forgot it or I just never had it. I mean, I had this pretty good sounding start. I guess I just expected that I would it would lead to a good ending but it didn't. So I just left it there and later when I went through to name all of them I, needed, I named it This Poem Needs Editing. Then I when I was going over a whole bunch of them. I'd always skip over that one because I'm still not sure what to do. Not sure how to fix it. And then I gave it the exclamation point on my whole master list saying that this one needs to be replaced. I'm done with trying to figure out how to fix it. Then I went to it today and finished it. <laughs> Didn't change the beginning part. I just added to it. Very busy planning on doing it all along. Sometimes I hate saying this because it goes against usually everything I say. But when I give up on a story, it seems. or an idea, sometimes it works out better for me. Like, don't give up on your main stories that you feel you need to write, but like your backup ones that aren't really good, when I give up on those, they either. I can then just move on from them, which is better, or they come back as better ideas because they want to be written about, which is better. So, so yeah, not your main story. Like, there's one main story I can never give up on, or I would hate myself forever, but some of the other ones I can and have, and it's been for the better. So, I guess my point is. Not to always just, you know, never give up because sometimes it's just not worth it to keep going. I mean, keep going for what when you've got better things to do, so. Uh, tip for the day. What did I just hear? Something like, ding! Kind of creeping me out. I'm also hearing birds tweeting it's 120. I thought they waited until the sun came up or whatever, but okay. Um, 
Let's see what else we got here. Words on a file. I wasn't sure. I counted 14 for some reason, but I wasn't actually sure because there's like, it's my master list and because I copied and pasted it from my um, table of contents, I didn't count those words before. And so I didn't count when I was editing them, but then I would add a note earlier today and count the words. Then I would delete the note because I no longer needed it and go take those words away off my file. And I kept doing that. I'm not sure if I should count them because those were notes that I needed. Or did I because I remembered them without the note, but they were there in case I needed them. And I did write them, but they didn't end there. So I counted 14 for some reason. I don't know. And 155 on a dedication page for my book. Um, it's pretty fun. Uh, I'm just loving that so far. I had an idea of what I wanted it to say. Sometimes you get in your head that you want to write it down perfectly. That doesn't work. Just write down the idea you have and fix it later. Um... Oh yeah, I realized earlier today that I had completely forgotten about that song I said I was going to post on DeviantArt. So it's on DeviantArt now, because I finally remembered it again. It's much better than my first one, off the things I learned from stage two in the writing course, um, songwriting. So there's a link, probably the first link in the description will be to that poem. Also, I can put links to external links, they're called, in my YouTube videos now through annotations. So annotations, will you please put one here for me? So, the awkward minute you realize you've been rambling way too long. How do you learn to shut up? So this is peace, love.